organs that will affect your thyroid. The first one's going to be your gut, and when you have leaky gut, it can cause autoimmune diseases like Hashimoto's or Graves that directly affect your thyroid, and they call it leaky gut because the little holes form in your gut lining and leak different things into your bloodstream, into your lymphatic system. So the next one is the liver, and this helps you turn your inactive thyroid hormones to convert them to active form and without the liver there's no thyroid hormones at all so that is a very important organ and then additionally when your thyroid isn't working properly or your digestive system isn't working properly your liver or your gut you will have less bile flow um, easily to your gallbladder which causes gallbladder pain and the gallbladder also affects your stool as well and then we have the pancreas, which is an endocrine organ. It creates insulin, um, balances your blood sugar, and without the balanced blood sugar, your adrenal glands can't do the work it needs to do, and they become fatigued. And when your adrenal glands are fatigued, that's really bad for your thyroid because your thyroid looks at your adrenal glands as it's like emergency backup. So if your thyroid isn't doing what it's supposed to do, it's not releasing hormones, your adrenals will come in as it's like sidekick to help it. And if your adrenals are not working properly because you're not balancing your blood sugar, your pancreas is not also um, working properly and not helping with your insulin, then your thyroid is also affected. So that's just a recap of some of the organs that do affect your thyroid because when people have thyroid disease, they typically just focus on the thyroid and thyroid hormones, but they don't understand that there is other organs that cause thyroid disease, that cause the imbalance of thyroid hormones, and you also want to look at those as well. If you guys have any questions, let me know in the comments.